Hey there everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode of Let's Chill, No Man's Sky. So, let's go ahead and check this out. See, for whatever reason, log extraction complete. It just bugged out and let me get the log extraction, so I'm just going to take it and go. Life goes on. Day after day, delivering after... I hope to go home soon. The life of a... Is not one for like me. Multiple sentinel energy signatures detected. Requiring immediate... Dropping out of warp. There's... There's... Sentinels. What are they doing? Fighting each other. The sentinel ships are engaging each other. Ignoring us for now. The sentinels appear to have departed. They're... Distress signal nearby. Broadcasting 16 on repeat. I'm going to take a look. Okay. Interesting. So now I need to actually salvage it. Let's see if I could salvage this thing. Yes, 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 yes. I know my thermal protection is active. Just destroy that real quick. Uh, door glitched out. You know, very strange fashion. Okay. Log encryption. Read the log of the crash freighter. Uh, extreme radiation. I don't know why it does that. It's so uncool. Alright. Let's see the log. Crew manifest missing. Limited data available. I do not know who will read this message. I do not know if anything will survive. But I must have... I must die as I lived. I will record it all, even in the face of oblivion. The swarm came to every world. The drones acted erratically, not attacking, just watching. Time passed and the sentinels did not seem much of a threat to anyone. They were peaceful now, we thought. We had been forgiven. We were wrong. Oh. So the sentinels legit just appeared one day and just existed amongst everyone else. The cargo pod down there. There's also a weather warning for a storm coming in. Um, let's see. I need my terrain manipulator to have more charge. Let's get some ferrite dust. This works. Holy guac juice. It's actually kind of cool. I've never been this deep inside of the damage trader before so I'm gonna wait for the storm to pass All right, that should be enough time. Let's repair that. Grab the encryption key. Fly out, fly out, fly out. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I was wrong. I was very wrong. Storm's still going. 
Oh great, radiation protection. Let's get back inside, cause I'm freezing. I'm freezing my nuts off. Alright, so now that that storm is over, let's go ahead and check out the next log. Ship logs requested. Accessing. They struck as one, an attack somehow coordinated across unfathomable distances. With a fury exceeding all prior skirmishes, the Sentinels annihilated all biological life within the universe within a span of 54.2 standard minutes. Excuse me? Only I remained. The Korvax stood with me in the end, to their credit. They concealed me within their flotilla towards the center. Oh, what is going on? What is that choppy, choppy movement? Oh, that's just... Okay, that's just a shadow. Of that as the sun crosses. You know, ray tracing. Uh, it's not really ray tracing, but it's whatever. Alright, so I got one more right up here. I gotta bail, gotta bail, gotta bail, gotta bail, gotta bail, gotta bail. Why did they make it so that, that thing just drops off massive radiation as soon as you pick it up? It's so uncool. But this should be the last log. Log integrity compromised. Patching. They are coming now. The screams of my friends resonate in every hall, every corner. The sentinels have found me. I told Nada to leave. I told them what we already know. All of us. We are not alone. Even if I die, Nada will find me again in another universe. Ten just like me. A thousand. A million. We are not alone. Where every soul is many. Even in the face of sixteen, we must declare that we lived. We existed no matter the horror at the end. They are at my door. I... Error. Unexpected law of termination. Oh. Alright. That takes care of that story. Huh. So now what do I do? Head back to space. Let's see what the log says. Activate the hollow terminus and speak to Null. Let's go find Null. Is there a hollow terminus around here? Oh, there's one. Alright, so let's go ahead and head over to the Hollow Terminus. And we will go talk to Null. And then after that, we will see what else we can do. Okay, yeah. Planetary interference. Yada, 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 yada. Alright, so it's down there. Let's see. I'm really actually super excited right now. I know it doesn't sound like it, it's just I'm trying to keep quiet. It's kind of late where I am. But I'm getting ready to record Borderlands 3. So it's going to be fun. I just have it installing. I still don't understand why the game is $60 on release rather than $40 and making the DLC stuff $60 and then making the Ultimate Extreme whatever edition $80. But whatever, you know. They gotta do what they gotta do, so I'm just choosing not to spend $60 to get some cosmetics, because I'm sure they'll re-release the cosmetics anyway. Like they did with Borderlands 2, and I'm not stressed. Hmm. Boom. Grab this. Hello Terminus activated. Multiple signal sources available. Nah, blah, 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 blah. We always said this. Speak to Nell. All right, mystery man, bring it on. What did you find out there? Tell me everything. I tell Null of the freighter and its recordings, of how it spoke of a world where the Sentinels eliminated all life, leaving only a traveler and a single Corvax entity. I choose my words with care. 
You think I did not know who the Corvax entity is? Do not be so naive, Traveler. Do you think anything you have read is a surprise to me? But I had to be sure of what I suspected. I know it now. The Atlas is with you. You could not see these things if it did not wish it. That freighter was a wreck from a parallel universe. There are multiple such places within our multiverse. Dimensions where things happen differently. But there are three exceptions to this. The Atlas is omnipresent in all. A singular being with a singular perception. The Sentinels move between dimensions at will. Excuse me? They are multi-dimensional? Great. Let's ask about the Sentinels. They served the Atlas once. They were the guardians of reality, defenders of civilizations. They hunted for errors within the universes, preventing destruction and loss of life. The annihilation recorded in that log? Well, something must have been quite wrong for them to do something like that. Let's see about the Atlas. The Atlas created all life, and the Sentinels defended it, searching for anomalies within that creation. That they annihilated an entire universe, well, something must have been quite wrong for them to do a thing like that. After a time, the uh, Sentinels ended their service to the Atlas. How do you know all this? I have been for long... Ugh. I have been alive for a very long time, Traveler. I know as much as you would know had you seen the things I have seen. It was the Travelers who corrupted existence. Our arrival was meant to herald a, a glorious age, but we made a terrible mistake. I... I committed an act beyond forgiveness, and from this deed, paradise was lost. But something is different in this cycle. The walls between universes, they grow thin. Nada knows this, but they keep their head in the sand. We must learn what we can from each species before we decide what to do. Visit a Viking station and speak with them. I will translate. Oh no, I wanted to keep talking, but fine. Alright, time to go find a Viking. Alright, in the T Wing. Alright, where's my Viking boy? Ow. Locate a Viking star system in the galaxy map. Alright, am I gonna go the warp somewhere? Wait, is this not a Viking system? No, it's a Corvax system. That's a Corvax system. Gek, Corvax, Emerald Drive, Indium Drive, Corvax. All right, hold on, let me... Let's go to the space station first. Um, that was strange. I flew through it. All right, let's see if I have any Viking star systems I can jump to. Let's see, what star system is this? It's Viking star system? No. No, it is not. I don't think so anyway, right? Let's see. No, this is a Corvax system. It's an 
not that one, not this one. Should. Corvax, Gek, Corvax, Bull Catch is Uncharted, Uncharted, Gek, Ah, Mikeen, Aelia, and Adikar 8. Okay, guess not. Tarv. There. Let's head here. Mm, where am I supposed to find this cartographer? There we go. Mission restarted. There we go. Thank you. Now that you're here, I don't have to worry about the thing. Let's go ahead and pop out, talk to this cartographer guy, and see what's going on. Ugh. Honorable. I have no idea what you're saying, Pro Viking Largas. As the warrior begins to bark, I feel a strange frequency vibrate through my skull. I see a flash of Null's glowing orb behind my eyes. Suddenly, the Viking's words ring clear in my ears. Rah! Pathetic interloper! Prying into the Viking's secrets! Cowardly spy! I should kill Grah! But... Traveler must be aided. Such is the command of Herc. Prove yourself, interloper! Retrieve the words of Herc. Ascend in Viking glory. Then you shall have your words. I will reveal only this. The location of Herc's command is marked for you. Commune with their words, Grah. Alright, well, bye. Um. A Viking artifact? That's it? Don't I have one of those? Unlike my ship? I swear I remember having a Viking artifact somewhere. All right, but let's go to the ruins, pick up the artifact, return back, and I think that'll be the end of the episode. Ancient ruin, okay, here we go.
this is considered an ancient ruin? Oh, there it is. Okay. First, let's get some of these words here. Wait, have I gotten some of these already? Hey, is it just those two? Hey, it's usually more than that. There's one. That was two. I guess it was just those two. Hey, right, no, there's a third one way over there. Alright, let's see the memories. The noble traveler will be spared. Their journey through the cosmos shall not be thwarted, so it is decreed. The will of Herc commands it. The Viking shall honor the judgment and belief of the ancients. Ancient knowledge passed down through generations of Viking warriors spills from the marker stone, flittering into my mind like a long forgotten memory. I begin to speak, and my voice is seized by an unknown power. I roar, taking myself up by surprise. None hamper the path towards Durindyarg as the Sentinels. They must be destroyed. Their time will be ended. So it is written, so it shall come to be. This the Vikings swear. I call out once more, my throat harsh and gasping, sound, sounding guttural. The words spill forth, summoned by the power of the monolith. The Book of Herc. Speaks of the rise. Ooh, excuse me. The Book of Herc speaks of the rise of the travelers. They shall ascend, delving into the boundless void. Vikings shall not impede their ascent, for the travelers must prevail. So decrees the word of Herc. As the words fade, their lines still resonating in a vision, I find myself in possession of an ancient tome. Oh, I got a Viking tablet. That's new. Oh, the sentinels want to kill me. Never mind, never mind. I don't want it. I don't want it. Just leave me alone. I don't want it. Oh, I don't even have any fuel cells. Oh, great. Joy to the friggin' world. I don't know how far away I am, but will this work? Yes, okay, I'm fine. Let's go ahead and give this to the cartographer here. Null wished for me to visit the Viking and learn what I could. Of the Atlas, the creator of all universes, the Sentinels, rebellious hunters of anomalies, and the Travelers, who committed some unforgivable act long ago. You have communed with Herc. You are worthy, Interloper. Make your request. Be bold! Oh, I want to know about all of them. 
Let's start with the Travelers. I want to know what sin we committed. The Traveler must be aided. The Traveler must prevail. Ask what this means. They repeat their words as if they not hurt me. Ask about the Sentinels. Enemy! Enemy! Destroyers of worlds! Servants of the liar! Atlas! Ask why the Atlas is a liar. Any being that claims to be a god is not one interloper. Progenitor Herc knew this well. Battle Brother Null did not. They died for a false dream. The Viking tells me of their history, of the wars with the Gek, of Korvax slaves and Tyrannus empires. The Viking suggests that if Atlas is a god, then it is insane. I am about to leave when I notice something on the Viking's terminal. Two digits blinking endlessly. They feel familiar. Let's ask about that. I. <sighs> What? Interloper. What face are? The Viking is visibly pained by the mention of the numbers, staring at their terminal as if they had seen it for the first time. Their words slur, a strange sound entering every sentence. Oh, did I break him? Oh, no, I broke him. Oh, no, I broke him. Oh, great, I broke him. Alright, well... Oh, time to speak to a Corvax cartographer. Okay. A cartographer. Um, is there a Corvax one here? Or that the... Yep, we gotta locate a Corvax system in the galaxy map. Alright, but we'll save that off for the next time, guys. I will catch you all here next time on Let's Chill No Man's Sky. We got a decent bit of story going, but next episode I want to get the rest of this like mission going and hopefully finish because i got a feeling i'm gonna have to touch the corvax and the geck as well but other than that guys this is the afro lad signing out and i hope you had a relaxing sunday today i will catch you all here next time on let's chill no man's sky i hope you all have a great and wonderful day